Hello, welcome back to Let's Play New Super Mario Brothers DS. Yeah. So you know we did the last part. We just pretty much finished the half world castle, and Toadsworth used his staff. <laughs> What's that staff do? What will it ever do for? I, I I know what it did for us right now, but he never used it. I mean, he used that staff for certain reasons, but he, he had a magical staff right there. That is not an ordinary staff. I know I cannot go over there. I know I cannot. That staff is a different staff. A magical staff. Anyway, forget about that. So, I, I, you know, we, you know, we did the last part. Whatever, forget about that too. <laughs> anyway, um, I, I forgot to tell you something in the first part. We actually, actually have the Wii version of this game. For the Nintendo Wii. New Super Mario Brothers. Wii! I don't know what the Wii stands for. I, I know what the Wii stands for. But the Wii... I, I, no, I guess it means for everyone to have fun. Like, Wii! <laughs> anyway. This Mario Bros. Wii is a really fun game. Yeah, it kind of has the exact same game. Well, not the exact same. Well, I want to say it's the exact same gameplay as this game. But the gameplay is kind of the same. You know, in some reasons. Some, the graphics are nothing the same. You know, DS compared to Wii. Everyone knows that we win between DS compared to Wii graphics. Anyway, forget about that. The Wii, the, the Wii one actually had a different. Ugh, I died. <laughs> I died there because I wanted to go inside that pipe and I, and I forgot to jump again. Not again. No, oh, never mind. Anyway, I forgot to jump and I f and I failed that part. Anyway, in the Wii version, you can actually pick up stuff. You know, you know, go next to a thing. You know, like a frozen item. You, oh, you, you also have different items in that. You have, you have a ice fire, you have a ice flower, fire, fire, fire flower. Uh, what, what was the other one called? The, the, the one that can make you fly. The, the uh, propeller suit. And then you have the, what's that? Like? Oh, yeah, the penguin suit. I'm gonna call it the penguin suit. If that is what it's called, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what it's called. And yes, I die again. Yeah, I didn't jump too high enough, I guess. Oops. Not, not, not that I guess. It's true. Anyway. Yeah. And also in the Wii version, you can actually pick up stuff. You can actually pick up stuff. Yes. You can finally pick up things. Because, you know, because after you freeze something with a f ice flower, you, you know, after you freeze an enemy with ice flower, like, you can actually pick up that, 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 the enemy you froze and throw them at different enemies. And it, it just, it, it helps. It helps a lot. And another thing is that, it, and another thing, yes, I died the same reason. I didn't jump high enough that time. In the way, another re another thing that you can do in that game is, oh yeah, is I forgot. Sorry about that. Is that you can actually stay in the air for? Yeah, I got a mega mushroom. Oh, screw, oh, screw that for a second. Mega mushroom rocks. Look at me. I'm, I'm abominating. I just like how, how they installed the big. The, the Mega Mushroom in this game. Mega Mushroom was a good install installment in 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 this Mario Bros. franchise. Anyway, I was saying before, yes, it ended, so I don't care about the Mega Mushroom anymore. Anyway, but like I was saying before, in New Super Mario Brothers for the, you know for Wii, you, you can actually stay in the air for a slight amount of time, like, a, like about one second. It's actually pretty helpful, you know, if you shake the remote in the air, you know, like he'll stay up in the air for quite a little while. It's, it's kind of helpful for s uh, some reasons. Not even at some reasons, pretty much all the time. You're gonna want to use that a lot. It's pretty helpful. It may not sound like it, but it is. Oh yeah, and there was one more. Spin where you're on the ground, and then Mario do that weird thing. Um, you know, um, yeah, you know, then, you know, the Mario do that weird spin attack that he did in, in Super Mario World. Uh, weird spin it, well, it's not exactly the same. I'm gonna call, uh, I'm just, I'm just assuming that it is the same move from Super Mario World. Anyway, you know, he's gonna do that real super, um, that, you know, that weird Mario, that weird spin attack that he does in Mario World. I, I think so, it's in Mario World. It's pretty, it's, you, you can actually jump pretty higher. You, you can actually jump pretty higher if you do that. Don't use it all the time, though. Because, it's not a good thing to use. Anyway, yes, I use the star coins, and I, I use my star coins, and I leave it with zero. Anyway, this Mario Bros. Wii is a good game, and I really recommend you get it for me. And that's the end of me talking about that. And this is this this is the mushroom house. Mushroom house, the way you do a new smart brothers we yes, I'm still talking about new smart brothers we the way you do that in, in new smart brothers we it's pretty I actually like the way you do it better in that game than you do in this game because you, you have a chance of winning a lot more lives. And I get pissed off because you use a browser and instead then I stop st I start stomping. 
on Toad's Worth. Because he doesn't tell me, because he never used that staff in the Mario Luigi series. That staff could have been helpful for many reasons. Anyway, we're not, here to, we're not here to talk about that staff. And this is the castle. The castle. I, I like the music in the castle really, like, the, the music was really well done. I, I actually liked it better in this game than in Mario Brothers Wii. Now, I'm always comparing this game to Mario Brothers Wii, and I know it's kind of the exact game, kind of, almost. But, yeah, I'm just comparing it to it a lot. And then there's Super, and then there's Super Mario 3D Land. I actually, I actually played Super Mario 3D Land, and I don't have a 3DS. So. Actually, I actually played it before. It's a pretty fun game. It's really fun. I, f I feel like I'm playing a console game, in my opinion. In fact, the whole 3DS feels like a console game to me. Yeah, the whole 3DS feels like a console to me. <laughs> I just said that right now. Anyway, uh, what was I gonna say before again? <laughs> I forgot. And uh, yeah, I don't have a 3DS. And yeah, that's too bad. I don't plan on getting one too soon. I mean, yeah, I'll get one. I'll get one, but I don't plan on getting it too soon. I know I'll get one pretty soon, but not right now, because, because I just don't, I guess I can't get it right now. And that was the mu the music in that place was really good. Yeah, I already said that. Anyway, we're in the cat. We're in the we got the boss, and I want to show you how I school Bowser. Just like his, just like I did the same thing to Bowser Jr. This is what I do to him. I just shoot fireballs at him. Oh no, I don't get it. Is Fireball strong against bosses? Well, yeah, of course, it's strong against bosses. But really, I just killed him like it was nothing. Mario should do that more often to Bowser. Because, like I just did right now. He, he should be doing that a lot more often. Because, really, because, really, he can do it in this game. But for some reason, he couldn't do it in the Mario Luigi games. Just kidding. I know the gameplay is different and stuff like that. Anyway, we're on Raw 2. And yes, he just carried Peach into the castle, into the half, half world castle. This is World Two. World Two is a sand, sand, um, sand thing. I actually like the sand world. You know, I actually like the sand area in this game. It's really well done. The, the, the place was the, the well, one thing the design was really good, especially the background here. Just look at that background. Pyramids. Pyramids are epic, of course. So, that, so that's why they put pyramids in the background. Who does not like pyramids? I, I know there are a lot of people who don't like pyramids, but I, I I haven't been in one actually. I don't plan on going on in one. And yes, I was confident in going, and I was actually confident that I'll make that jump and not get hit. And I wasn't. I, I just didn't make it. What's the problem? How did I not make that? Anyway, uh, what to say anymore about this place? Well, the background's nice, well done, like I just said right now. And the theme about these things, I mean, the theme about this place, and yes, I die there. Because I didn't jump high enough, again. Like I said before, my jump's not good enough, I guess. My jump's not good enough. And I didn't make it there. Anyway, like I was saying before, the theme about this place, you have these weird piranha, not, not piranha plants. These, ugh, I die again because I forgot to, no, I don't think I forgot. I just slid off, I guess. Well, because of those. This, the theme about that place is those weird. I never knew those names. Those weird guys' names. Anyway, yeah, these guys. They're kind of annoying. I didn't like them. Even in even a Mario car, I never liked them. And these guys get quite annoying. Like I just said, why do I always say the same things I said before? Oh my gosh, I, I didn't know I died this much. Wow. Anyway, I have a giant mushroom on the bottom screen. I'm not gonna use that mushroom until I actually get to a boss I can't do until I, or until I just feel like using it. Actually, and yes, I almost, I almost got, I almost died there. And luck, and I, I also forgot to say about the, you know, about the giant mega mushroom, you know, you know, before when, when, when I was using it, that, you no, know, before, you know, before, before, when I was using on this part before. Anyway, you know. The giant mushroom is pretty big, and you can crush stuff in your path. I'm not gonna use it till we get to a hard boss, because those things can really help on bosses. You can pretty much defeat every any boss in this game with that mu with that mushroom, that huge mushroom. They never they never put it in Mario Brothers Wii because of course Raw well, didn't want to see gi four giant people running on the screen. I mean, I would like to see that. I guess I guess it was too much power or something. I'm not. I, 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 no, I'm not good. I'm not good with this kind of stuff. 
Anyway, I'll see you in the next part. Bye.